Dear viewers, welcome back to our series Ask Dr. Doshi. This is the third video in this segment and today we are going to talk about one of the most asked questions to me is Dr. Doshi, I am ready to undergo deep brain stimulation surgery, but how long would the effect be last? This is a very important question and if I was undergoing surgery, I would also like to know that. I can answer this question in just one statement and that is that the effect of the surgery will last till the patient lives. But this is not going to satisfy you and I know that. So let me get a little detailed into this and explain you what I mean by this statement. Parkinson's disease as we all know is a progressive disease. As the disease progresses the symptoms changes and symptoms worsen. Before the patient undergoes surgery he would have understood this by the time he comes to me for surgery because he started with a very mild symptoms maybe on one side of the hand maybe initially only there was slowness then a little later some tremors came and then after two three years of just having a little bit of medication and then getting full relief the other side start gets involved and after both the sides getting involved after few years then he's continuing to take medicine he starts getting side effects or he doesn't get the same duration on the quality of on period that he used to get on period is the definition is defined by that duration of when the patient is more or less symptom free so the patient by the time he comes for surgery he has already gone through the journey of worsening of the disease and he is scared or is worried that if this same trajectory continues he would be very disabled over a period of time that is where the surgery comes in the surgery comes as a supplemental role and plays a sub supportive or supplemental role in the overall management of parkinson's disease after the deep brain stimulation surgery the patient would have two things it would be having an army and an air force to fight the battle the air force is the surgery army is the medicines we do not replace army and we all know that in any war and this is a war against parkinson's disease if you want to win you have to take help of everything available you can add navy in terms of exercise i don't mind so we now have all the three forces fighting against parkinson's disease and depending on the war strategy exactly the similar way the war strategy changes from particular geography of the war to the particular period or duration of the war or particular time of the war or particular purpose of the war same thing happens for patients of parkinson's disease a expert person who is managing patients of deep brain stimulation changes his strategy based on the requirement of the patient somewhere he will use more medicines somewhere he will use more stimulation somewhere he will use more exercise you have a gait problem lot of gait difficulty we use lot of exercise to help you there if you have tremors which is getting uncontrolled we use stimulation to do that because we know it is the most effective you get some depressive symptoms we use some medicines to add and give you the benefit so it's a game it's a game that is continuously played not every day but every few months or every 6 months or a year between the doctor and the patient and the parkinson disease to win over parkinson disease so once again the disease will continue to progress there is no way we can stop the progression but with deep brain stimulation surgery you would be always several steps ahead of controlling and managing your disease than you would have been with only medicines alone so surgery doesn't stop the progression but it definitely make sure that the disability that is coming with advanced diseases is less and less disabling and much more manageable i hope i have answered the question basically the surgical effect or the effect of deep brain stimulation will continue to last till your lifetime this is an interactive channel this is a channel for you between you and me so i would like you to put down all your comments or questions that occur to you the questions that you want me as an expert to address or answer to be put down in comment section so that in the next segment of the video we can collect all that and share adequate and relevant information pertaining to that